Told you can Episode 12 of my pickups. Um, pretty good finds this week. Uh, I was in a Savers here in town, and all the way from the front, I could see this on the back shelf. And I've been wanting, needing to find a Nintendo 64 boxed. And this thing is in awesome condition, except for this little, this little bit right here. But the rest of it is just, it's just awesome. Um, styrofoam. Everything's in there. Uh, it even had a the memory pack or jumper pack or whatever the hell it's called um, in the '64, so that was pretty cool. Um, it was $24.99, um, and then 25% off, so whatever that is, it's like 18 bucks or something. So good deal. Happy to pick that up. Um, the six Sega games in that Super Nintendo, um, Lion King. I was in a Salvation Army, and these were all marked. Uh, where is it? They all say 450 on it. And I was like, well, the only one worth 450 on here is uh, this Batman game. This Batman game is actually worth like 15, 15 to 20 bucks, um, and it's complete. So I took it up there, and the guy was like, "Well, I took this one and the Road Rash, which didn't have a price, or, yeah, it didn't have a price tag on it, and I took the Lion King up, and I was like, there's no price tags on these, and he was like, oh well, they're all 50 cents. I was like. Really, he was. Uh, he said even the Batman was too. I was like, "All right, well, I'll go back and get the other Genesis games all for fifty cents." So for those seven games, I got them for three dollars and fifty cents. The Genesis, rest of the Genesis games are just fillers for the collection. So, but they're all complete, good condition. Um, the Lion King, horrible box. I mean, there's no there's no cardboard, nothing, no manual, nothing. But I mean, the game's in good condition, and it was only fifty cents, so I couldn't I couldn't leave it there. Um, this I picked up at a Savers as well. It's a dollar ninety nine, twenty five percent off, so a dollar fifty. Um, never find these, so I picked it up anyways. It's missing the front, but whatever. It's a NBA game. Um, picked this up at a savers as well Mortal Kombat 2 I got that for a dollar ninety nine and then back to one of my local uh, game and video stores uh, with the outrageous prices um, they always hook me up every time I go so I keep going back there um, some more stuff I didn't have in my collection they had this marked at three ninety nine it's like a $15 game, uh, Splatterhouse 3 on Genesis, so that was a good deal. Um, all these have different prices than what I actually paid on them. I'll tell you what I paid for them when I go through them. Um, where's Waldo? He gave it to me for $1.99. Dungeon Magic, $1.99. Double Dragon 2, which is funny. I don't know if you can see underneath this. I wish I could get this off. They had it marked at, look at this, $211.99. That's what I'm talking about, outrageous prices. Um, they just throw whatever they see on Amazon, even if it's sealed or whatever. Who knows? Um, but yeah he lowered it to $6.99 I was like well I'm not even going to pay that because there's a little crack on the top so got it for three bucks good deal I need it for the collection uh, world class track meet $1.99 um, pirates was I actually got this for three dollars <clears throat> so that's a killer deal um, these are some fillers Caesar Palace Big Hurt Baseball Lagoon. This was, I think, two ninety nine because the sticker's peeling up, but I can glue that back. 
um, Monday Night Football dollar ninety nine, and Donkey Kong Country three it says twenty six ninety nine, but he gave it to me for eight ninety nine. <coughs> I have to replace the back because the sticker's missing, but um, that was a good deal. And something, this came out a year before I was born, nineteen eighty. Uh, it's a Radio Shack. Uh, mini computer game. Uh, it's got Stellar Escort and Defense Command. I thought it was cool. I, I don't know why I picked it up. Maybe you guys can tell me what it's worth. How it was actually used. Um, I don't know. It's got you know the mini computer cassettes or whatever. Which is... I don't know. I, I know nothing about it. So I know you guys... Somebody out there knows. <coughs> But I thought it was kind of cool. It was uh, two bucks. It was half off, so picked it up anyways. But this is episode 12, and please subscribe and comment and all that good stuff. And see you guys next time.